what's going on? It's your boy, Tim McRae from WTF Food and Music. Two things that will always bring people together. And today on the show, I got a mega superstar, restaurateur, podcaster, and aspiring actor, Tim McRae is in the building, y'all. Hey, listen, man, Tim, thank you for having me, bro. Listen, what you doing with WTF Food and Music, it might be getting overlooked by some people, but it's amazing, man. All my people and followers, make sure they check you out every time that you want, man. Thank you for having me on the show, brother. I really appreciate it. Yo, listen, we ain't gonna waste no time. I always ask people, what is your version of success? Break it down for us, Tim. You know, Tim, that's a really, really deep question, and I can start in so many different ways, but I have to start by saying the first definition of success is health. Waking up in the morning, man, being blessed to take that first breath, to be able to inhale and exhale, that's the first level of success, because without that, your day is pretty much done. Mm -hmm. So to answer it briefly, to me, um, my idea of success is doing what you love, or you're listening, focusing in on the things that make you happy, and chasing your dreams, and being consistent. Because success means so many different things to other people, but it just really depends on, like you said, your version of what is the definition. To me, that definition is doing what you love, man. Focus in on whatever it is that makes you happy. Yeah, that makes sense, that makes sense. Uh, getting to that next level. Uh, being surrounded by the right people, uh, uh, being in a position to do the things that you love. To me, that's my definition of success. Yeah, it makes sense. So, Tim, I gotta ask you, if you were trying to give advice to somebody that was trying to break into acting, podcasting, or just starting their own business, what would you tell them? You know, Tim, first and foremost, the first thing I would tell them is, stay away from the naysayers. Stay away from the people that stagnate your process. And what I mean by that is, you'll know those ones, you know, the people that want to hang out and drink all the time when you're trying to do something else. Mm. The people that just don't care about what you're doing. When you're trying to get to another level and grow, you have to sometimes elevate and, and be separated from these people. Uh, and, and, and I hate to say it, but, you know, it's just the only way you're going to get there is to get that ultimate focus and, and focus on what really means the most to you and what you want to do. I mean, I don't know how else to say it. Yo, that's incredible, man. Listen, Tim, once again, thanks for coming on the show, man. You really dropped some heavy, heavy stuff on my listeners. And I just want to tell everybody out there, sometimes it's always good to have a conversation with yourself. Thank you.